The people with disabilities marched a short distance from the town center to the regional council where Dr. Mbambo was on hand to listen to their demands and receive their petition. Their spokesperson, Marcellus Haivera, did not mince words as he demanded a stiff sentence for the accused mother. What have we done, we the people with disability, that such things happen to us? What have we done, we the people with disabilities, that we have to be killed like that? The residents asked government to introduce protective measures for people with disabilities so that they do not live in fear but lead productive lives like other citizens. On his part, Dr. Mbambo said the murder should be condemned because all citizens have the right to live freely without fear, irrespective of their physical, social or mental status. The entire region, Kavango East, and I think the entire government, is really saddened and shocked by this event. We are supposed to assist our brothers and sisters, our children, uh, sons and daughters who are disabled. Who knows? Today, I'm not disabled, but tomorrow I might find myself in that situation. He said disability was not a sin and therefore no one should be punished or treated badly for being disabled. The deceased Magdalena Nunyango was suspected to have been hacked to death with a panga before her body was set on fire on a barbecue stand.